What's up? This your boy, Mr. T Money 1993, with my thoughts after this third preseason game. Uh, defense and special teams was fucking amazing. If you doubted our defense, even though we had a top 10 defense, I don't understand people. This game shows you what our Panthers defense can do. We looked amazing on defense and special teams. If you watched my before video, I mentioned Ted Ginn was going to be returning putts. First time he gets a putt, he takes it back 74 yards. Jukes the first man and then just burns everybody else. Uh, then we came, we came back on defense. The offense didn't do that good tonight. I mean, they did all right, but anyway. So next time we scored, uh, it was we was blitzing in the a gap. We had our two middle, we had our two linebackers blitzing in the middle, and Joe Flacco thought he was gonna have a hot route on his receiver. Well, the receiver kept on going, and uh, it sailed, and Drayton Florence got a pick and took it back 71 yards. Easy. I mean, that's why we signed Drayton Florence. That was a bad read on the receiver, but I mean, we're not gonna take it. Shoot, we ain't gonna say nothing about it. Anyway, so then. What happened? There? What else we did good on defense? Oh, when they tried to run the ball, and uh, Luke got the ball. No, uh, Pierce. Pierce for the Ravens got the ball, and Luke just <laughs> snatched him up real quick, caused the fumble. It rolled near the end zone, and Thomas Davis picked it up and just rolled in the end zone. Luke played like a man tonight. He had seven. Yeah, like seven tackles. He had that. He had a pick. He had a forced fumble, which he, uh, which is one Thomas Davis took back. And uh, he also had a nice hit on the. Uh, who was that? Shashenko, I think. Or no, no, no. It was one of the receivers running across the middle. Luke laid the boom on him, and the ball went up in the air, and Godfrey got it. But they called a penalty on it. So uh, after that play, I guess Luke said, "Y'all can call a penalty on me anyway." Uh, Joe Flacco goes to throw, and Luke steps in front of it, reading his eyes perfect, and uh, takes off. He didn't return for a touchdown. It was only him and Joe Flacco left, and he went to cut the juke Joe Flacco, and he slipped. But uh, it was still a great play. Uh, we won 34-27. Uh, the Ravens didn't do that good against our starting defense. What did I tell y'all this offseason? Star and Kawan and Dilwan in the middle. Star was throwing them linemen in the backfield every play. Getting he got a sack and he had uh I think he had like four tackles. He had like three tackles for a loss and a sack. And he was just he was looking like a man. Um What's the other? We had three defensive touchdowns. Drayton, Thomas, and uh, who had the other one? Oh, DJ Moore on Tyshawn Taylor before he got hurt. Mike Mitchell. <laughs> this is why I wanted him to start at safety. Mike Mitchell lays niggas out all the time. He done, he been knocking niggas' helmets off and shit. He gave Tyshawn Taylor a concussion. Tyshawn Taylor thought he was a shit running around and shit. And he juked like three of our people and tried to run to get the first. And Mike Mitchell laid him out. You all you see is that nigga on the sidelines covering his head. Like, why did he hit me? <laughs> um, I mean, Baltimore did a lot of scoring against our backups. Even the uh, the the touchdown pass Joe Flacco threw. We had our backup defensive lineman in, and we had our backup secondary in because DJ Campbell was in the game, and he made a bad jump on the ball. Offensively, I mean, it was just field goals again. We wasn't able to get in the end zone. I don't know why, but, I mean, Cam and the Panthers' offense never really looks good in the preseason, never since he's gotten in the league. Cam had one sweet run uh, where he escaped the pocket, though. I mean, he did what Cam does. But I mean, the offense should look better. Smitty's not Smitty's not only gonna have two catches in the regular season. Greg Olson's gonna have more than three catches in the regular season. Uh, what else? I mean, 
Mike Mitchell did his thing. He had uh he had like ten tackles. But anyway, of course after the game, anybody who knows ESPN I'm sorry, uh anybody who knows ESPN, of course they started dick riding on my Panthers. John Gruden throughout the whole game talking about uh Luke Keekley is better than 99% of the middle linebackers in the league. He can win defense MVP before his career is over. Yada, yada, yada. You know how ESPN do. Somebody does good. They start dick riding somebody. And the first time somebody slips up is, oh, my God. Like that whole getting on cam because he puts a towel on his head and he looks discouraged after games and stuff. Who wants to lose? Like, what the fuck? It doesn't make sense to me. But anyway. Yep, 34-27 win. We got the Steelers for our last preseason game. The starters probably won't play hardly at all because it'll be more about seeing who we're going to cut. Uh, Hickson didn't play. B's in play. And, of course, John Gruden said what I've been saying the whole off, the whole off season. Shit, they should just put me on fucking ESPN. Talking about uh, we might have one of the best front sevens in the league. I was like, duh. And I don't understand how people say something about our defense. We had a top 10 defense last year and still added people and still got better. We strengthened our weaknesses. Uh, Captain got hurt for a little bit, but he was back on the sideline, so that's good. Um, I don't think we had any other in-game injuries. Anyway, this is Mr. Team Money 1993. Just for my thoughts after the game. I'm ready to get this last preseason game out the way. And then uh, ready to play the Seahawks week one. Mr. Teammate 1993 is going to be in the building. I'm excited. I'm pumped. I'm ready to go. Uh, other than that, I'm trying. I might be able to go to the Campbell UNCC game next week. I'm trying to go. Uh, if you don't know, I uh, used to go to Campbell University. So. That and uh, UNC Charlotte's my mom's alma mater. And uh, she tried to get me to go there, but this is their first football game in their school history. So I'm trying to see if I can get some tickets. I heard they're sold out, but I don't know. But anyway, week one versus Seahawks, I'll be in the building. It's Mr. T-Money 1993, and I'm out.